Hi guys, welcome back to iMyPhone channel. Many people want to permanently delete their old Apple ID when resetting their iPhone or changing to a new Apple ID. However, deleting an Apple ID can be quite tricky. Don't worry. This video will show you three easy ways to delete an Apple Idaho permanently, even without knowing the password of Apple ID. Let's get started. Way 1. Delete your Apple ID via settings. Let me show you. Step 1. Open settings dot and click general. Step 2. Click reset and erase all content and settings. Step 3. Enter your passcode when prompted, then click erase iPhone. You'll need to enter your Apple ID password to proceed with the deletion. But what if you forgot your password? No worries, just keep watching the video. Way 2. Delete your Apple ID via iMyPhone Lock Wiper. With iMyPhone Lock Wiper, you can delete Apple ID without passcode with a success rate of 99%. Let me show you how to do it. Step 1. Click the link in the comments to download Lock Wiper. Launch it on your computer and choose the Unlock Apple ID mode. Connect your iOS device to the computer, unlock the iOS device screen, and select on the firmware package online. Step 4. Six start unlock. Enter 0000 and click unlock. Once the process is complete, the Apple ID account won't be in the device anymore. And now the previous Apple ID account has been detailed. Now move to setting you can reset the Apple ID and the password now. Way 3. Delete your Apple ID via iTunes. Step 1. Connect your iPhone to the PC. And then put your device into recovery mode. Instantly click and release the volume up key and then the volume down key. Press and hold the side button until you see the this screen. Then open iTunes and restore your iPhone. Now you can click restore to try resetting your iPhone to delete Apple ID. While using iTunes, you may find that iTunes cannot reset your iPhone for some unknown reason like this. So we recommend using Lock Wiper for a smoother experience. Okay, that's all for today's video. Remember to subscribe to our channel. If you found these methods helpful, share them with your friends. See you next time. Hello everyone welcome back to iMyPhone channel. Taking off mobile device management from an iPhone can be difficult, particularly if it's controlled by your workplace. They may have rules to stop you from removing it. This is quite distressing, but don't worry, this video will help you bypass MDM. If your company or school manages the MDM profile on your device, the easiest way to remove it is by contacting the device administrator. Ask them to delete the MDM profile, and it will be removed. If you can't reach the administrator, you'll need to remove the MDM profile yourself. If you have access to the device, go to Settings, then General, and select VPN and Device Management. Here, you'll see the installed MDM profile. Select it and choose Remove Profile. You might need to enter the administrator password. If you have the password, you can successfully remove the MDM profile. If you don't have the password, you might need to use third-party tools to bypass MDM. I recommend trying iMyPhone Lock Wiper to bypass MDM. Click the link in the description below and download iMyPhone Lock Wiper on your computer. Step 1. Open iMyPhone Lock Wiper and choose the Bypass MDM mode from the first page. Connect your device via a USB cable. Step 2 It will guide you to follow the instructions to start the process of removing MEM lock or you may need to reset your device first. Please make sure the iPhone is on MDM remote management screen before you start to bypass MDM on lock wiper. It will now start the bypassing process. Just wait a few seconds. Your iPhone slash iPad MDM profile will be successfully bypassed. Your device will enter the reset recovery process. After your iPhone restart, it means that the MDM in the device has been successfully bypassed. Start enjoying your device now. That's all for today's video. Remember to subscribe to our channel. If you found these tips helpful, share them with your friends. See you next time. Hello friends, welcome back to Imiphone channel. Are you facing this situation? You've forgotten the passcode for your iPhone that you haven't used in a while. Actually, forgetting the passcode for your iPhone is quite common. If you want to unlock your iPhone without a password, you've come to the right place. Before we show you how to unlock your iPhone, it's important to answer a question that many people care about, will unlocking your iPhone cause data loss? The answer is, it probably will. Unless you've backed up your iPhone